Good morning and welcome to this thought for the day. Uh, the verse that I'm looking at today is James chapter 3 verse 10 which says out of the same mouth come praise and cursing my brothers and sisters this should not be. What a challenging verse this is but it is so true. I know that I have said things that I should not have said things that are not always helpful. You would have thought that as God knows what we're going to say before it comes out of our mouths, he would have a handy little zip to pull over our mouths and stop it from coming out, but afraid not. However, we do have a God who forgives and sets us on our way again. However, with forgiveness comes a further challenge, to not do or say it again. I don't know how many of you watch a quiz show which is on daily called Pointless. It's on every day of the week and the aim is of the game is to get the lowest score for an answer. The question has also been put to a hundred different people. So as I said, the aim is to get a pointless answer from the answer that's been given by these people. And there are all sorts of categories, geography, film, history, and also a word game. Now, I learned a new word the other day from a word game. The challenge was to find a three-letter word ending in Y. We can think of many answers, I come sure, like pay, way, why, say, but not maybe a pointless one. The word I learned was UE, U-E-Y. I have never heard of it before and it means to make a U-turn. This is what we need to do after confessing our faults to God. We make a UE and the power of the Holy Spirit will help us not to say it again. So are we all ready to take up that challenge? Amen.